exist anymore. Some of the guards are trying to hold on a man named Jeff Myers. Oh, Mike tried to, to type this really quick about his backstory before something happened. And please, if this story has been found, please tell anyone to be safe before he kills you. <sighs> Alright, it all started that Jeff Myers was a normal 14 year old boy. But he said that he had someone with him that made him into this the way he used to be. At 10 p.m. ever since his mom and dad are gone for now. He just went to the kitchen and grabbed the largest knife he could find. But then he just killed his brother Connor Myers 25 times of stabbing. But then when he would just walked to the basement, he just cut a smile around his cheeks and put some oil around him. And even worse is, he burned himself for whatever no reason. And then his parents found him dead, but they took him to the hospital really quick while they stopped the fire. But for some two hours later, ever since Jeff is still wearing his clothes, he just killed his mother and father, and even some people around the hospital at night. Some of the nurses called the police, but Jeff killed the nurses, and he just ran out of the hospital and went to the forest and never seen ever again. But, f but five months later, some people had survived of being attacked by Jeff Myers, and some people said that Jeff Myers said, "Go to sleep," when he killed him. <sighs> all right, I get that's all about his story for now, because I can, I can still hear some noises that some of the guards being attacked by Jeff Myers, but he only called himself as Jeff the Killer. But I still remember that he just left me a tape of telling me to tell his story around the world. So that's what I did. I hope anyone can see this story. And remember, don't be just like that him, okay? Are you in here, Brandon? Because if you are, <laughs> I will surely stab you a lot. Just like as my parents. <laughs> oh god, no! Are you ready to go to sleep? <laughs> Hell no! <laughs> Miss! <laughs> ah! <laughs> Hello, everyone! You may not know me. But I might know you. But anyways, I wanted to say, Brandon, thank you for telling my story a bit. But he had to go for now. <laughs> Lucky that I had some emails of all you so I could know where you live. Or anything. <laughs> if you see me staring at you at night, you'll go to sleep. This is Jeff Myers here, and I'll see you at night, bitches. Goodbye. <laughs> <laughs>